Football is back. I'm Jack Halada, and there are three takeaways from today's training camp. Number one, Dennis Allen doesn't let emotions get the best of him. He's out here to work. Did you take a minute just to sort of drink it in, the first practice, you know, what it means to you? Did not, you take, no? not really. Not really. It, it, I mean, this is about getting a football team ready to go play a regular season and win football games. And so um, I didn't really think anything about myself or anything that was going on around me. It was just kind of tunnel vision on how do we get better. And, and you know what? Here's the thing. That's the message I'm pre preaching to our players. And if I can't adhere to that message, then, you know, what, what good is it? So um, it really is tunnel vision, one step at a time, all those cliches that you think about, but they're, but they're real. Number two, Jameis Winston, awesome at press conferences, excited to have the media back in the building. Game one, I'm going to make a decision. Game one, I'm not even thinking about my hair, right? I just want to look presentable for y'all, right? I don't want to have my hair everywhere. Uh, but, you know, you catch me uh, 10 days in camp, you know, who knows what my hair is going to look like. Well, but, uh, know it's time, is it tied, though, to your injury rehab? Uh, well, it, I'm, I'm just not cutting it until I step back on the field. And number three, and finally, Michael Thomas is back on the field. I'm kind of lost for words. I didn't want to come up here and get emotional or anything, but it was a blessing to definitely be back out there with the guys, being able to put my hand in the pile and just be out there to perfect my craft. And we couldn't be more excited. Reporting from Metairie, Jack Colada, Boot Crew Media.